Hi everybody, it's Caitlin McDonald here with the Social Speak Network and in today's video we are going to dive into how to export the URLs for um, blog posts or for pages in your WordPress website. So there are lots of different reasons to do this. One is to make adding, bulk adding redirects uh, really easy. You just have a list of all the old URLs. You then add all the new URLs and then you um, upload that into the redirection plugin, for example. In this case, we're actually doing it for a slightly different reason. And it is so that we can easily go through all of the blog posts on a website and add meta descriptions. We are recently looking at the Google Search Console and uh, this had data that basically was saying the site shows up over 250,000 times um, in search results, uh, but it's only getting about a thousand clicks out of those. So our goal is to increase that click through rate for it showing up in the organic listings and actually getting traffic. Um, so let's jump on over. I'll show you the plugin that I use and then how we are using it in this situation. So the plugin that we're using is export all URLs. You can just do a search in the uh, WordPress plugin directory for this. Um, we've been using it for a few years now, have never really had any issues with it, uh, but just check to make sure that's compatible with your website installation first. So again, here it is, export all URLs. You're gonna find it in the tools of your WordPress dashboard. And then here you can select what type of information to uh, download and so into export. So for us, all we wanna do is the posts, but you could do all types. Again, if you're maybe changing the permalink structure or something like that, um, or you wanna have more control over it, uh, you might wanna just download everything and it does all posts and all pages. And so I want to include the titles, the URLs, and then the categories just to make it easier for, for us putting together those meta descriptions in this case. Um, we want them to just be the published ones. And I'm going to keep all of this the same. Um, and I just want a CSV of them. So you just click export now. And it will export to your computer. And I am going to copy this and just put it into a Google Doc. And the reason why I'm doing this in my situation is because here we're gonna also add the meta descriptions. Whoops, if I can write descriptions. And that's totally spelled incorrectly, but that's okay. Um, so again, super simple process. You can do it uh, <laughs> without any trouble whatsoever. Um, it's that export all URLs plugin right here on the screen. And then you just select what types of information you want to export and the additional uh, data here as well. It could be very um, worthwhile to export post IDs, for example, if you are trying to um, do sort of a bit more advanced functions within your WordPress website uh, where you need those post IDs. Uh, so this could be just a really easy table to refer back to as well. So I hope that this has been um, informative for you. Of course, if you like this video, uh, if you're looking for more advice, more tips for WordPress websites, and uh, specifically the Enfold theme is what we utilize and Gravity Forms, um, we utilize those in a lot of our websites, please subscribe to our channel. Leave any comments down below if you have questions or if this worked for you, we'd love to hear from you. Thanks so much, and I will see you in the next video.